Hello and welcome, it is time for level 4 beast friendship quest. Look at all my gardeners getting stronger and stronger. That is beautiful. Alright, what you got? Let me guess, you're depressed again and you need my help to feel better about yourself. I feel lost, I don't have any responsibilities here. Well, close enough. I'm kind of busy right <laughs> now. A hobby seems so frivolous. If you don't want my help. What if you run an errand or something? Borrow a book from Merlin for Bell. Yeah, that sounds helpful. Do stuff that I usually do. Wow, somebody who feels like they don't have enough to do? My god, we could be best friends. You can do every task that I get assigned. The enchanter? I prefer not to. What? Why? What did Merlin do to you? I get why you might want to keep your distance a bit, but a book is a good... Oh, because he's a wizard. Oh, okay, I get it. I've been wanting to get Bell some new ones. Wait, but if, if Merlin is a wizard, why can't he maybe figure out how to reverse the curse? Is that possible? I don't know. I've been wanting to get Bell some new ones. All right, she had difficulty borrowing books from Merlin. It seems others have lost them and he no longer likes to land. We already fixed that, don't worry. Why don't I help you out with that? Wait, what? I already did. Oh, she's just gonna... We're just gonna... We're just gonna steal the books. That makes sense. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna bring the beast on this journey. He needs to... He needs to know how things work around here, so I'm gonna teach him. I wonder if he can... I don't think he can sit on any chairs, right? My friend. He says, my friend, and then yells at me like, 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 like a beast. That was rude, man. That was very rude. Look at this vine wall. Oh my god. Mouth-watering. Alright, Merlin is not here, so just grab all the books and let's run. One... Uh, two, and three. And now run before he shows up. Run, 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 run. Wait, I thought he needed a hobby. Why am I bringing the books to Bell? I don't get it. How is, how is that helping anybody? This makes no sense. Are these books for me, Star and Sky? How kind of you. Thank you, the beast, not me. I'm just a delivery person. What do you mean? What did he actually do? He didn't do anything! Mm. Thank you for helping to get them to me. I know he's not comfortable speaking with other villagers yet. Yeah, what's up with that? <laughs> he's a bit shy. Though I don't think he'd admit that. What do you think he needs? He could be used a friend, someone with a quiet disposition. He spent so long in a castle with only his servants for company. I think he's forgotten how to make new friends. Wait, who has a quiet disposition here? Uh, maybe... Everybody's so loud. Maybe Remy? Beast and Remy, best friends. That could be a movie. Who to try and introduce him to? Friendly and who would be patient with him? I have no idea who you're talking about. What about Wall? Oh yeah, Wally actually. Okay, Wally is super quiet. Wally and a Beast. That's even a better movie. I would love to see that. I I would pay to see that. Perhaps he and the Beast would work together with plants. Oh my God. Mirable, she helped us out already. Okay. She's used to managing the personalities of the whole family. The Beast's gruffness wouldn't bother her. Okay. Okay, we got. Wally, Beast, and Mirabelle. The marvelous trio. In a theater's near you. <laughs> That's awesome. That is really awesome. Alright, Wally boy. I got you a new friend. Yeah, if you think about it, Wally is the perfect friend for Beast. Quiet. Like, very kind. 
And he cannot judge. He literally cannot judge him for his looks because he's a machine. I hope nobody programmed judginess into him. Hey, Wally. What's up? How's the gardening going? Yeah, that's good. I was wondering if you wanted to maybe make a gardening buddy. Look at those strong hands. He can pull all the pumpkins in one go. It's the beast. Have you met him? I'm trying to introduce him to more of the villagers. Uh, Wally doesn't seem to be happy. Are you scared of the beast? Oh! <gasps> That's it. He, you will never see him again. He's gonna be very, very self-conscious now. Don't be. I know he's a big and maybe a little scary looking if you're not used to him, but he's got a big heart and he just wants to make some friends. Oh, that was easy. That was easy to change his mind. Let's just do this for everybody. It seems to be working pretty well. Uh, all right. Let's go meet with Mirabel. That's so that's so awkward that Beast got to hear all of that. I hope he, he was probably not listening. I'm sure he doesn't understand what's happening. Uh. What's up, girl? Have you met Beast yet? He's a little new to the oh. valley. We've spoken a little. He is not really chatterbox. <laughs> not everyone finds it easy to meet new people. When we finally talked to my Tio Bruno into moving out of the walls, he was still pretty shy in crowds. Lots of people are just shy. Yeah. I'll be happy to spend some time with the beast. That is very kind of you. What's the plan? Why don't you ask him to come see me later? I have a sewing project he could help with. I don't think his hands are meant for sewing, to be honest, but... Yeah, okay. Bye. I don't know how this is gonna go, but hopefully really well. It took an eternity. Oh, come on. What do you mean? You were right here with me. I, I, I just talked to her, turned back straight to you. Now I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm sorry, please go on. Yeah, that was rude. Hold him accountable. Come on. I spoke to a few of the villagers and arranged for you to meet and get to know them. Mm. That's amazing. Oh. Terrifying. Yeah, you'll be fine. Wally is the sweetest little robot around and would love to do some gardening with you. And Mirabel is so friendly and has an uncle who also not always comfortable around people. She loves sewing. Yeah, you're going to be great help for that, I'm sure. I don't know, Mirabel or Wally. Could you choose who I should meet? Just one, though. That's that's all I'm prepared for in one day. Yeah, Wally is definitely a better choice. I'll show you the basics you'll need for gardening, and then you can go hang out with him. Those hands are made for gardening. I think we just averted a disaster. Che teach beast of the secrets of gardening. All right, we can do that. We can do that. So we can plant... I have some seeds on me. Six seeds to be precise. We're gonna need ten though, so let's grab a couple of random seeds. And let's do this. Alright, beastie boy, watch this. So first, you dig holes. Like this. You dig ten holes. Now, we plant... The seeds. Watch and learn. I'm sure Wally could have taught him. I'm gonna do 12 just to make sure you get it. And then how to harvest crops. So, and then we harvest crops. Well, I had my potion, so that was handy. Then we harvest it. And just ignore the golden crops, they're useless anyway. Just waste waste of time. And just like this. You got it? Now you do it. Oh my god, the whole ground is shaking when he's running, that's hilarious. Hello, little contraption. <laughs> that's a good start. Don't be afraid. Wally? 
I should have known this would happen. Yeah. Yeah, well, they're, they're so awkward. The two most awkward people. I can't even understand what you're saying, which makes it perfect. He cannot, you cannot say, say he doesn't like you if you don't, what, what, stop, no running. There's no need to be gentle, Stirring Sky, that was a disaster. It wasn't that bad, but yeah, it could have gone better. Maybe Wally wasn't the best match for you, but I'm sure there's someone in the village with similar interests to you. Why don't you tell me what your ideal day of hanging out with a friend would look like? <sighs> Mm, someone who doesn't want me to constantly talk and share. That is literally Wally. What, what's this is match made in heaven. Someone come who don't who won't be startled by my appearance. Wait, what if you go with one of the lions? Lions are also beasts, so they wouldn't be startled at all. You should go with Simba, or with Nala. If there's someone like that, I would be very much like to meet them. I heard Christoph is trying to get fishing contests going. I'll talk to... Oh. Oh, he was raised by trolls, so he definitely not gonna... Okay, that is a brilliant idea. By the way, Christoph is not on the map right now. He has vanished from face of the earth. Oh, never mind. He's on the beach. Hello there. So, uh, I kind of need your help. Yes. I've, I've seen him around, but we haven't had a chance to talk. And now you can. He's trying to meet new people. That's great. It's just... I'm not one of those super sociable people. So if he's looking to hang out with a big crowd... Oh my god, they're perfect. Okay, I take it back. They are perfect. Yeah. You might want to try Mirabel. <laughs> Actually, that's why I came to see you. Because you're awkward, just like him. I bet you'd have a blast fishing together. Uh -huh. He wants to fish, I'm all in. You're joining us too, right? Yes. <laughs> I've been having a fishing contest and there's a few guidelines. You need to catch at least four fish. Two salt water and two fresh water. You also need a herring, a bream, and one fish has to be at least three pounds. But they can be of the salt water and fresh water catches. Okay. Oh, oh boy, that sounds complicated. Hey, all right, beast, here's a riddle. Catch fish. Done. Don't worry about it. I can try that. I've always liked fishing. The silence is enjoyable. Wow, you really do need my help. <laughs> oh, man. I'll let you find a spot you like for the contest. I'll check back in later to see if you two are getting along. Okay, that's the spirit. Bye-bye. Wait, do I need to do the contest now? Oh, yeah, of course I do. All right, so a herring and a bream. Let's start with that. So that's that's the things we know, and then we can figure out the rest. So the herring, actually, you can catch one on the beach. So let's try the white bubbles. I think it's beach and glade of trust. There we go. Bream is definitely meadow. If I'm not mistaken, it's a red bubbles in the meadow. I'm, I'm a local fishing expert, by the way. In case you didn't know, so should be pretty easy for me to win this contest against all these noobs. <laughs> Sorry, that was rude. All right, we got a bream. Now we need three pound fish. Usually legendary fishes are all three pounds or more. So we're going to catch this legendary fish for my final freshwater fish. And then we're just going to go catch another herring. That should be easy. For wait, three pounds or more. Ooh, how can I make sure that the fish is three pounds or more? Does it say it on the fish collection page? Or I just have to keep fishing until I get a three pounds or more. Where do I even see the pounds? Wait a minute. Seriously though, where do I see the pounds? I don't think herring will be three pounds or more. Oh, it does say 2.2 .2 pounds. I never even noticed that. I think I'm going to lose the context contest. I 
I just realized something. The fishing rod got fixed. Let's go! Okay, legendary fish in Forgotten Lands has to be over three pounds. It just has to be. No chance it's not. I can guarantee you this. Sixty-six point one pounds. Now that is definitely. Wait, how is the hell? How huge is that fish? So beasts did beast catch anything? Let me guess. He caught like fifty-five thousand pound fish that was about to eat the Dreamlight Valley in one big gulp, and he saved the world. And now he's the winner of the contest. Now that is a movie I would watch. <laughs> All right, talk, boys. So, are the fish biting for you? A couple. You? Yes. That is awkward. <laughs> I love these guys. They're best friends. Nice day for fishing, huh? It is. Perhaps we should do this again. We did it! They're best friends now. Hello. How did it go? I caught a bit of your conversation. Seemed like you two hit it off. He's someone who doesn't see silence as a thing to be avoided. From from you, this wide an endorsement, yes. We said maybe a dozen awards to each other over the course of the contest. Yet I feel like I've met a kindred spirit. Awesome. This is hilarious. Why is it hilarious? I try to get you to talk to people, but the person you vibe with the most being silent loves being silent. It is hilarious. It is pretty amusing, I agree. I'm happy for you. I am happy for you, beastie boy. Are you leaning for a kiss or something? Thank you, Star and Sky. I made a few new friends, and now I hope that Belle will be less worried for me. Yes! Your kindness will not be forgotten. It is done. And I have a bunch of this somehow here. What? That never happened to me before. Alright. I enjoy this quest a lot. I kind of feel like I would... Uh, probably be a kindred spirit to Kristoff as well. He just seems like a simple guy with great values. Nothing fake about him. Not that the other Disney characters are like that, but like like imagining him in real life, I think we would we would be pretty good friends. So that means probably me and a beast, beast would vibe too. I also sometimes enjoy some silence. So that quest was very personal to me. I enjoyed it a lot. Let me know in the comments if you can relate to it as well. And huge thanks for supporting the channel. Subscribe for more content. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.